so students exponential form of algebraic quantities in arithmetic we have seen that when a number is multiplied by itself a certain number of times it can be expressed in exponential form uh, this is very easy actually uh, i'm going to show you suppose if you write a into a you can write a square understand a into a into a it will be a cube we have already discussed okay again uh, if you expand suppose 25 a to the power 5 b to the power 3 how can we expand it so you can write 25 into a to the power 5 means a into a into a okay into b cube b into b into b clear so you can expand it also next uh, we can now directly go to let us do 6.1 uh, a1 you see variable in the expression twice x minus 3 <coughs> uh, it is definitely x okay next two number the constant term in the expression 36 plus 7 actually this questions uh, it is the question of 6.2 actually mm, by mistake uh, it is uh, this question is given here okay uh, we'll discuss about terms monomials binomials in the next class okay but i'm going to say you the answer the answer will be uh, seven okay seven the constant term in the expression is seven so how the answer is seven we'll discuss in the next class okay because this question should be in 6.2 actually by mistake uh, they have given here okay next question number three each side of a regular pentagon is l then the perimeter is regular pentagon you know five side five sided polygon is called pentagon so perimeter will be five into side all of you know here side is l that's why your answer will be five l okay next six four number six a to the power four b cube can be written in the product form product form we have already discussed so option a will be here okay option a is the correct answer b1 the area of a rectangle is expressed as length into breadth that means area of rectangle all of you know that it expresses length into breadth all of you know the length of a rectangle is thrice its breadth length of a rectangle is thrice its breadth that means if breadth is suppose x then length will be definitely thrice x means 3 into x thrice x means 3 times x so find the area of rectangle in terms of breadth b Oh, you cannot take breadth as x because it is given that breadth should be b. Okay, you 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 should take breadth as b. So <clears throat> how do you write the answer? So you just write solution and you just write let breadth of the rectangle is b. Okay breadth of the rectangle is b therefore length equal what will be the length three times of its breadth therefore length equal three into b three into b means three b okay you just write in your copy okay next uh, you should find out the area of rectangle so area of rectangle you know the formula it is given also here uh, length into breadth so therefore area of rectangle equal length into breadth but here length is what length is 3b and breadth is b that's why area of rectangle equal 3b into b equal 3b square 3b into b equal 3b square okay 3b square is the answer so you will just uh, note down in your exercise book that means copy Two number express the following in exponential form. Exponential form means in power form x square added to y cube. x square plus y cube you will write. Okay, very easy. 
so these are class work two number questions and three number also express the following in product form product form we have already discussed suppose uh, 10 suppose two number 10 x cube y to the power 4 you will write 10 into x into x into x into y into y into y into y you will write like this okay so two number and three number these are class work for you and you will show me within two hours okay four number no need actually it is a logical match and we will discuss later on okay so it's enough for today uh, in the next class we will discuss from terms okay terms monomials binomials factors coefficients these are the topic we are going to discuss in the next class okay now you do your classwork and you will show me within two hours okay so it's enough for today bye bye